everyone, Sam here, and uh, right now on Way Too Late TV, we're going to be doing a little bit of bite-sized battle tech. Uh, just as a uh, break from the uh, Endwalker stuff, um, mostly because my internet is out right now, and um, I'm kind of wanting for something to do. Um, can't really help but do something that doesn't require internet right now, and Battletech doesn't require internet, so yay for that. So anyway, we're going to be doing a little punching above our weight class. Um, that's kind of how you get the uh, bigger mechs in your lineup. So um, let's head on over to the big board and uh, find out exactly the specifics on what we're going to do. Come on with me. Way too late to be. Well, let's turn on the camera. All right, and let's bring down the top. Love that. Anyway, um, we're just going over... Um, yes, Commander. Ready for orders. Standing by. I hear ya. All right, I think we're good there. Um, let's head over to the board. And we're going to do uh, Take the Bait. And uh, Commander the Torian Concordant is tracking an extremely heavy mech with pirate heraldry. The provocation is almost certainly bait for a trap. We'd like you to spring this trap, engage the heavy mech, intercept the forces the local pirate organization sends to defend it, and destroy all of them. It's a three skull mission. Battle in the Highlands. Um... Max salvage 315, max pay over a mil. Uh, we're going to take the salvage here. 3 of 12. 353k. Torians are going to get a uh, bump up to uh, indifferent. Pirates are going to remain at uh, whatever the hell they're at. Um... And, uh, we're going to, uh, let's see, um, who are we going to bring here? Um, we're going to bring Hellburner for the Blackjack. Um, Coldfire, you are not coming on this mission. I'm sorry, you are garbage. Moon Rabbit, you are coming on the mission, though. And Deckhand and Long Shadow, you're fine. Slurms McKenzie, um, ooh, 30 LRMs, woo, really, the things I get excited about, and then the Vulcan, um, honestly, that's just so little firepower, that is so little firepower as well, so, um, yeah, I guess we'll go with what we got here, Nixie 10, Narc Beacon, Narc Beacon's really going to help out with Slurms. And then UAC-2s... Okay. Let's head over to the battlefield. Looks like it might require more firepower. Let's, let's do it just in case. We're in the area where the hostile mech was sighted. Now move up and try to flush it out. Let's see what sort of trap this is. Stay alert, Commander. Oliveira, out. Now, when I say punch above our weight class, I really do mean that. We are, uh, really above our weight class here. Let's see, they're gonna be over there, and there's probably gonna be reinforcements over there. Moving to position. Alright. Moving to position. Roger that, Commander. What are your orders, Skipper? Hey, uh, yup. Slurms is gonna reserve. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. It's a vehicle, and Heading then this over. is, um, that looks like a panther. Orders. Centurion's gonna move up. Fire off at the cicada. That is a cicada. Firing full complement on enemy. That didn't hit. It didn't hit. Bandit. Okay. That's a lot of damage. Losing lots of armor. That's fine. Orders? 
Blackjack is what we call a sentinel. It stays put, and it uh, fires 2%. Jeez, just go for the center mass. Roger that. Take that. Stays put and uh, fires off as Paper. needed. Flurmsy is just going to fire off missiles. Look at all that structure that damage right now. That's good. Got it, Commander. All right. Oh, yeah. Look at all that percentage there. That means this is going to hurt. Firing my weapon. I think I hit something good. All right. Oh! That's a demolisher. Under heavy fire. That thing's got two, uh... Ready to rock. Okay, that thing needs to die. It's got two AC-20s. That thing needs to die and needs to die now. Damage is minor, because that will chew us up. Receiving you. Confirm. And it's Hell dead. Yes. Okay, there we go. Reporting. Enemy vehicle eliminated. What is that? That's a Vindy. Okay. Damage That's a hunchback. Right. That's a flashback, actually. Flashback is the uh, laser variant of the Hunchback. Waiting for orders. Now the Blackjack is going right after that cicada. And, here it comes. and it's dead. Hope we can salvage that. Commander? I think we can salvage that, yes. We're going to move right there. We're going to Vigilance to get rid of the... Uh, uh, Unstable damage. And we're going right after the Vindicator. Primitive. Head hit, okay. so it go. takes off one point of health of, of the pilot. Slurmsy's going after the Vindy. I got you. Structure exposed. Good, yep, good. Man. The Vulcan going right after that Vindy again. There goes its right torso and right arm. That's another point of damage against it. If we can, if we can scrambled egg that pilot, um, and scrambled egg being a uh, uh, technical term, you know, um, basically uh, make scrambled eggs of the pilot inside the uh, cockpit, um, kill the pilot without damaging the mech, then that uh, gives us three pieces of, uh, for orders. three pieces of salvage. Um, I don't like the odds on those shots. I do like moving right about there, maybe? Roger that. And I'm going to Vigilance to reduce the damage taken incoming. Uh, you gain guarded and entrenched and remove all stability damage with Vigilance, and your next initiative is increased by one. So I'm going after the Vindicator. Um, actually, no, I'm going to uh, go for the Vindicator and then put the Narc Beacon on the Hunchback. Acknowledged. Left arm is destroyed on the Vindicator, and the Hunchback has the Narc Beacon attached. Now, the Narc Beacon increases the damage that uh, the mech takes from uh, missiles. Much armor left in that location. So, uh, Slurmsy, when Slurmsy fires next, okay, I'm going to move over here with Blackjack and take out the Vindy. So when Slurmsy fires next, um, it's going to be on the uh, Hunchback. And it's going to do uh, significantly more damage. There we 
There, there, I like those numbers a lot better. 68 and 74%. There we go. Five damage apiece for the uh, LRMs, for the long range missiles. All right, Centurion's gonna move over there and just take out the Vindy. Good night. Ooh, left leg destroyed. Ouch. Centurion's on its ass. Boop. Oh, I'm hit. Okay, Moon Rabbit is in the hospital for a few days. That's that's all that means. Uh, the Blackjack's gonna come around, uh, going to go after the, uh, left, the right torso, which is where the, uh, bulk of the medium lasers are. You can see how many goddamn medium lasers this goddamn thing has. Now let's see how you handle this. Okay, yeah, uh, it's got Reporting 60 health left on structure on the, uh, medium lasers on the uh, right torso. Roger that. Going right there, and we're going right after that right torso. Confirm. Ah, come on. Come on. Reporting critical hit. We got critical Roger. hit on three of those Confirm. medium lasers. Slurmzy. We need you, baby. We need you, baby. Go after that right torso. Confirm. Right torso, right arm, right leg destroyed. Good lord. You inflicted some nasty on that some bitch. Yeah, you did. Nice job. That's two full damage out of three your off of uh, the health of that thing. Uh, we're going after the uh, left leg. I'll take the center torso destroyed, sure. And that just that just kills it out outright. All targets down, Commander. Good shooting. Mission successful. And that is how you fight above your weight class in Battletech. Let's see what we get. Okay, 353, 850. Moon Rabbit's injured for 18 days. That is unfortunate, but unavoidable. Um, we get two pe- No, we get one piece of a Hunchback, one piece of a Vindy, and, uh... May as well just go with that one piece of a Cicada. Guaranteed. Um... Two AC-20s, two medium lasers, a me ba -ba -ba -ba. machine gun, a small laser, two heat sinks, and a jump jet. Partridge pear tree. Good enough for me. Let's hit up the barracks. See, uh, see Deckhand was on that one. Uh, Deckhand will pick up two health. Uh, Training complete. See, who else was on that Hellburner? Standing by. Hellburner cannot quite pick up Ace Pilot yet. That's all right. I'm receiving you. Long Shadow was on that one. He cannot quite pick up Call Shot Mastery. That's okay. Ready for orders. And Moon Rabbit was on that one. Um. Where was I going with Moon Rabbit? Was he going for? Reaching shot or for coolant vent? I'm gonna make an executive decision and go for breaching shot. Mech warrior training complete. All right. Let's go to the mech bay because one of my mechs, the Centurion, is gonna need a refit on that left leg. Narc ammo and AC-10 ammo. Do I even have narc ammo? Yes, I do. Good, good. And AC-10 ammo, I'm going to have to hit up the store for. And they don't have it at this damn store. God dang it. Oh, well. I can I can survive with 16 shots of... No. No, I can't. I can only do 8 rounds of AC-10. UAC-10. Um, Alright, well... um. I'll spread the love around, and I will max out armor. Let me just, uh, get this 
all sorted out real quick. I think I'm good. All right. There we go. 72,300, and it'll take three days. The crab, on the other hand, I should be using a lot more. Because those things are tough as hell. Tough as nails. Tough as nearly hell. All right. Either way, that is how you punch above your weight class in uh, Battletech. And uh, let's join me over at the other big board. Way too late TV. So I want to thank everyone here for joining me on uh, this quick episode of Bite Size Battletech. Uh, I will be back next time. In the meantime, you can join me any day of the week, any, any time of the day at waytoolatetv.com. For all your way too late TV needs, uh, that is uh, http uh, colon slash slash waytoolatetv.com. Um, the S is not there. Um, it's not that it's not secure. It's just that, uh, it, it's, it's weird. Anyway, that goes to my link tree. Um, the link tree has, uh, all the links that you could possibly need. It's got my YouTube. It's got my Twitter. It's got, uh, playlists for, um, pretty much all of the, uh, series that I do and a couple other bits and bobs that you uh, may find interesting. Um, in the meantime, uh, good night, my night owls. Sleep well when you get there. Way too late.